Hey guys, what's going on? It's your favorite heating appliance microwave here, and for today's video, Ubisoft just released some new information about the operator gadgets for the upcoming DLC Operation Ember Eyes. So I'm gonna play the video real quick, and I'll be back right after to talk about it. Stress test, got a hook. Previous session terminated after unacceptable levels of cervical acceleration deceleration. Commencing test, now. 2.001, unsuccessful. Stress test, 2.002. Hmm. Huh. Mm-hmm. 2.217. 2.17 meets safety design criteria. Volatility test. Vulcan Shield version 1.001. Jordan, if you're watching this, you owe me a drink. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, look at this dummy. Yo, look, look, look. Yeet, doink. Oh my god, dude. This video is so cool. I absolutely love it. It's not like uh, super scary or spooky like the knock one or anything like that, but this one is super cool. I absolutely love how they showed like the R&D testing effect of it. You can hear Mira actually talking about some of the, uh, the testing and what she was doing to implement these new gadgets. Super cool video by Ubisoft. So the first thing I want to go and talk about is the new gadget that you can see here. This is going to be the attacker's gadget, most likely, obviously, because I mean, a defender doesn't really need to propel herself you know from the ground floor to a window so this is like uh some sort of ninja operator like some sort of ash thing she's gonna just just yeet herself right into the window inside of a barricade and just kind of like get inside the objective and just you know make the plays like super quick so this is really unique like i'm not really kind of sure how this will fit in the meta but like i think it's gonna be super super cool it's uh unsure if this will work on some sort of castle barricade i'm assuming it will i mean unless you just kind of like just you know push yourself right through i don't know if there's going to be any explosion here it doesn't actually look like there's going to be any explosion um i don't even know if you'll be able to crash through the barricades like i guess that's a question here because you can see these uh dummies like it's just an open window so maybe you have to shoot it out or something like that but this is the attacker's gadget this was uh you can also see on the left hand side of this image here this was released by ubisoft yesterday for the ember rise reveal Ooh. also they're gonna be doing a reveal on sunday this yeah this next sunday i'm gonna be there i'm gonna have a video detailing all the new stuff about the new um map which is a rework of canal which is already announced by ubisoft um and the two new operators which are the uh, girl defender or the girl attacker and male defender which you again you can see on the images here so I'll have gameplay with a bunch of other YouTubers. Also, I'm doing a face reveal like the day before. So if you want to see what I look like, I'll be doing that. Because also at the event, there's a content creator uh, cup where like I'm going to be playing with a bunch of other YouTubers and big streamers and stuff like that to compete for uh, just bragging rights, I guess. So it's going to be a super cool time. Uh, you guys can check me out there on sunday i think the face reveal of a video will be here on saturday so we will build up hype and all that good stuff but also if you're going to raleigh let me know i'll be able to say hi what's up to you so yeah you guys will see what it look like anyways let's go uh right back into this video here so i'm pretty excited and kind of nervous about it anyways uh the second gadget here looks like some sort of deployable shield and you can see here that the window slits are there i'm not sure if they're going to keep the old deployable shields and then maybe that this is the new deployable shield. Like, I know they said that they were going to implement deployable shields with the little window slits, which we've already did a video about that. I'll put a link in the description if you guys want to check that out. We did some testing with that. Uh, I don't know if this is going to be, like, uh, only his has the window or not. I'm not sure. But it looks like you can see this poor little thing put this uh, little canister, this flammable canister on the back of this. Uh, deployable shield <laughs> the pistol comes out and just fires around into it and explodes and kills all the robots so i'm assuming this is going to be some sort of like uh scorched earth tactical operator here i just want to say that i don't know if a twitch drone will be able to uh explode this thing i'm assuming it will because mira's canister is metal and it's susceptible to the twitch drone but i'm not 100 percent sure if a Twitch drone can just, you know, hit this and blow it up, like, I don't know. Like, you can really get some cool content with this. This is going to be a really, really awesome uh, DLC by the looks of this. Again, I'm going to be testing all this stuff out 
Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below of the new operators. Again, face reveal coming up this weekend. I'm going to be playing the new operators, getting you guys that content. Don't worry. This is going to be such a cool operation. Can't wait to share more with you guys. I'll keep you guys posted. All right, real quick. I was going to end this video, but I did see something online. I don't want to bore you with all the details of what all this stuff says, but it does say here that she can go through barricaded windows. So that is pretty neat. I'm still not sure if she'll be able to go through castle windows. I don't think she will be able to, but who knows? But there's something on here that I actually saw that uh, made me think. It says that she turns uh she's gonna turn our whole routine upside down now i'm not sure if that's insinuating that she's gonna be able to go through hatches like maybe it latches up and she pops out and right up over it i don't know that's a really cool thing i hope she actually can do that because that would actually change the way the game is played actually um and canal is actually a, a map known for having like a top heavy site and there's only one way to get up i know they're gonna be reworking it but i don't know i really hope that is the the case here also, uh, I do want to sh show here that it talks about aerial denial with Smoke's Toxic Babes, and that's kind of like the premises that uh, his shield, the Vulcan shield, is going to be doing. So I'm assuming it's going to be a shield that explodes and maybe does like a dot fire over time, maybe like some like Capital, uh, so that way it gives uh, some sort of aerial denial for uh, Smoke, because if Smoke gets banned, there's really no way to stop a plant other than like Maestro and Echo. I mean, those are like slow effects, right? But there's no like instant kill except for Nitro cells. So this could be another area denial effect. Again, I just wanted to go ahead and uh, talk about that. So yeah, the reveal, August 18th. Can't wait to see you guys on the video. You'll see me live on stage at twitch.tv slash rainbow six. Love you guys. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.